How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here, and today we're gonna be checking out Cryonaze and Q-Stone's Royalty Pack. This is a mod for Brawlhalla that replaces a lot of items in Brawlhalla. This is a pretty big pack. So let's go ahead and take a look at it before we jump in and actually play some games with these awesome new mods. So let's check out some of these things. I know what you're thinking, these are awesome, right? They're so crazy looking. Uh, you get the loading frame, the UI theme, uh, the, the throne emote, and the avatar. And that's not even all, that's the tip of the iceberg. But don't you guys think it's, it's a perfect combination almost of Goldforge theme and Asgardian theme. I really do love it. These are the gauntlets. The orb is incredible. I love it. I love how huge it is with the wings. It looks even better in the game. Uh, that's a spear. It looks like a scythe, but it's actually a spear. The katars, the axe, the lance, the scythe, the cannon is just insane. The great sword, I believe. The regular sword. The bow, which I don't know if this big red thing, if, if this is a blade, that's pretty cool then, because then it would make sense. Because in Brahalla, you do hit with your bow, like you smack people with the, with the bow itself. You're not always shooting arrows. So it would make sense to have a blade on the bow. The hammer just looking like a royal scepter. And uh, yeah, they didn't actually show a close up of the blasters, but that's what the blasters look like. All right, that's all fine and dandy, right? But there's actually, even though the mod is free, there's three things that you do need if you want to use everything in the mod. So you're going to need the Brawlhalla Collector's Pack, which is $100. <laughs> uh, I know it's expensive, even though the mod is free, they, they skinned the weapons that come with the Brawlhalla Collector's Pack, the Asgardian weapons. Um, you also need the Throne Emote, um, which we do have. And uh, the Battle Pass Season 1 loading frame. That's the loading frame that it uses See, it says Demon Gate, but it's actually the uh, the royalty mod pack. So, other than that, uh, the mod is free. I'm gonna leave a link to it in the description of this video. If you want it yourself, you do have to be on PC. And before you even ask, nobody else can see the mods that you have installed. Uh, obviously, only you can see your mods because the files are only on your computer. All right, instead of playing ranked one v one or even experimental, because that would take seven different games to show all 13 weapons. Let's just do strike out because I can do three legends in one match. So that will show six weapons in a match. So I'll only take three matches to show all the weapons. So I'm going to play, like I said, Mordex, Jayun, Linfei, Thor, Azoth, Lord Vrax, and one other legend. Um, we're going to go ahead and start it out with Lord Vrax. And I already have the beautiful Asgardian Lance and Asgardian Blasters equipped. Look how amazing it looks. Oh my gosh. In fact, I don't even need that much dexterity. Let's just take one dex away and give her strength. Stance, and then we're gonna go ahead and do Azoth. I've been wanting to do Azoth to Azoth lately. They haven't really used this skin very much. Uh, we got the Asgardian Bow and the Asgardian Axe equipped. Last but not least, we're gonna be playing some Thor, and Thor has hammer and orb, so this is what the hammer looks like, and the orb is one of my favorite parts in this entire mod pack. It looks so awesome. All right, so this covers six of the weapons, and then we're gonna do six more after this match. Oh, actually, I forgot to show you guys, I did get the Brawl League avatar, so that's cool, but I forgot to show you the avatar from this mod pack. Uh, this is it, Collector Signet. Normally, it looks uh, not nearly as cool as this, um, it's just another thing you get in the collector's pack of Brahalla, so I will show you the throne emote, uh, but I'm gonna wait till the actual game starts to show you the throne emote. But look at this lance! Oh my goodness! It is so beautiful. Alright, here we go. Go against INV Sauce God. Alright, here's the throne emote. <laughs> look how awesome that looks. Even his throne looks awesome. He doesn't see it like that, though. All right, here we go. Oops. He want, All right, he wants to toast. <laughs> now let's fight! These blasters may look very mean, but they shoot bubblegum. Man, how many times I gotta down light and side air? Down light and side air. That's all I gotta do. Oh, down sig. Never mind. 
Oh, got that spot dodge punished. So this is the Lance. I'm only going to use it for a little bit because we're going to actually KO ourselves so that we can see the other weapons, all right? I'm not trying to make this a super long video because I know it easily could be with this many items in the mod pack. All right, we better, we better KO ourselves before he actually dies. That's the Lance and the Blasters, though. Let me know what you guys think. They are so cool. He has no idea what we're doing here. <laughs> All right, let's check out the axe and the bow. While we're also trying to KO Jiro over here. I actually do want to see the bow, but the axe is okay. Like, the axe is probably my least favorite. Just because it doesn't look as crazy as the other ones. Not, like, over the top. The bow, man. I actually, at first I didn't really like how it looked, but when you're actually using it, having one side be red and the other side golden is really stand out, you know? It looks really cool. And like I said, whack, when you do that little side air, it's like you're hitting them with that red part, which is like, very satisfying. If, in fact, that red part is like a big sword or something. Alright, I think you guys have seen enough. Oh my god! Alright, well that was the axe and bow. Who do I got? Oh yeah, Thor. This is like the best one, the, the orb. Check it out. Oh my gosh, look at that orb. It is so beautiful. No, I'm drinking my own cup now. <laughs> I will show you the hammer too. Ooh, nice side stick. Oh my gosh. No, not like this. Oh. There's the hammer. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should not have done that. Dude, I'm so bad at fighting with Thor. I don't... Ooh, I almost got him with that. Oh, Thor! Oh, well. Anyways, that was the hammer and the orb. <laughs> really cool, right? All right, so we're gonna do Lin Fei. And by the way, I, I choose these legends specifically because it covers every single weapon. It's not like I prefer playing these legends or anything like that. If you're new to my channel, then uh, you probably don't know, but I play every legend in Brahalla. I have every legend with black colors unlocked. Like I've, I've just, I just play all the legends. So Lin Fei has cannon and katars. This is gonna be beautiful. And then uh, we're gonna go Jayun because Jayun has great sword and sword, and they, they just look amazing. And then we're gonna go Mordex. Mordex has Scythe and Gauntlets, and this time we're gonna do black colors. See what these weapons look like with black colors. I don't know if they're actually affected. No, they're not. You know why? Because the Asgardian weapons have the same look no matter what color you have on your legend. Kind of like the Skyforged and Goldforged uh, weapons have the same look no matter what color you choose. Same with Asgardian. And those are the only weapons that do that. Goldforged, Skyforged, and Asgardian. Alright. We're going against Ungrateful Mike. He's got Mordex, Artemis, and Moonin. So, Linfei is a legend that a lot of people don't play for some reason. I don't really know why, because I think Linfei is actually super cool. Look at how awesome these weapons look with the colors being black and like... I don't know, they just look awesome to me. Perfect read. Alright, let's get the cannon. Katars are cool and everything, but look at this cannon! Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to die like this. Uh, <laughs> I ain't gonna mess around when he's got gauntlets down there. This cannon just looks so mean, though, don't it? I mean, it's beautiful and deadly looking at the same time. Trying to learn cannon like I'm so bad with it. Okay, sometimes I'm bad with it. Actually, we're gonna KO ourselves now. I forgot we wanna go through all the all the legends. Alright, here's Jayon. Sword and great sword.
Boom! The great sword is pretty cool. I like how it has the teeth on the other side of the blade. Kind of, kind of likes it look like it does more damage than it does. The sword actually looks beautiful, kind of like the katars. Ooh, nice side sig. No, I threw my weapon underneath him. Oh, if he would have done a neutral sig instead of a down sig, it would have been a direct hit. Oh ho ho, I gave him a haircut. Whoa, nice down sig. Alright, we we were on Jay on too long anyways. More decks. This is probably the one that most people want to see, right? Bro, I, I can read what he's doing and I'm still struggling to hit him. Let's go. The scythe is actually really nice looking. It's, it's kind of a nice combination of elegant and, uh, you know, deadly looking. The gauntlet, same thing. They look just just a nice balance. Boop. <laughs> and they, they make every legend that they're that's using them look even cooler, in my opinion. The throne, uh, how can you complain? The throne just looks absolutely stunning. All right, that was uh, six legends. 12 weapons. There's one weapon left. If you guessed what it was, congratulations. It is the spear. So the spear is the only one I didn't show in a legend. So we're going to play Mirage because Mirage has spear and scythe. And I just think most people like scythe and spear. We'll go back to the, uh, the Asgardian scythe and uh, if I can find it. Oh my goodness. And then the Asgardian spear as well. I've actually been looking forward to using the spear because I have not used it yet. I've only seen a picture of it and it is, oh my gosh, look at that. Mirage. The scythe actually looks beautiful on Mirage. Um, let's do all scythe legends. I know that most of the audience likes that. Let's do Jiro. I'm still gonna use the royalty weapons on all of these uh, legends just because that's what, that's what we're doing here. We're showing them off. And then, uh, who's somebody else that's popular that people like to play? Mm, Artemis? Let's do Artemis. Uh, let's do Charge Doji on this one. Artemis. All right. Hey, it's Ungrateful Mike again. The same guy we fought before, I'm pretty sure. Um, but anyways, I'm excited to see the spear, you know, and I think, I'm not a weapons expert, but like, isn't a spear with a blade on it? Uh, isn't that called like a halberd or something like that? Bye bye, Mike. We are playing strikeout, but I don't really have to KO myself this time because we've already seen the other weapons. We're just looking at Mirage now, like the spear. And look at that spear. Woo! It feels like it gives me extra reach when it doesn't. It's just a skin. that side sig look at that so much range and power and just it's OP if you all enjoy the video please drop a like helps the channel out oh oh moonin what's happening oh I should have done gravity cancel down light oh my gosh I could have had a sick clip there oh well he, he jumped. I didn't expect him to get in the perfect position. He did. Oh, well. I should have went for it just because I already was up two stocks. You know what I mean? Oh, that was so dumb of me. I don't know. I thought for sure he would jump up there and I'd get a neutral stick. All right. We're not going to we're not going to collapse this like this. We got to we got to finish strong here. 
Whoa, nice dodge. Not that time. <laughs> GG, dude, GG. Alright, guys, well, I think I showed everything in the royalty pack. Uh, I'm just gonna check again real quick. Yeah. So that was uh, Cryonase and Qstone's royalty mod pack. I'm going to go ahead and leave a link to it in the description, like I said. And uh, if you don't know how to install Brawlhalla mods on PC, I have a video. It's kind of an old video, but it's still accurate. So I'm going to post that in the description as well. And as always, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.